Today's a big day for the Navy and a big day for America. We're demonstrating the Great Green Fleet today, which is a carrier strike group where the service combatants and aircraft are running on a 50-50 blend of avgas and biofuel or diesel and biofuel. This helps us address a military vulnerability of foreign sources of energy and helps us establish a domestic competitive source of energy to fuel our fleet. Right now with the price spikes we've got on oil and gas with the places that we buy our oil and gas from, we're simply too vulnerable to that, to the, to the price spikes and to the supply for that. When the price goes up, we don't have but a couple of places to go get the money, either from operations, which means we sail less, we steam less, we train less, or from platforms, and I don't want to have to make that decision. This gives us a competitive domestic source of fuel, and it's a big day for the sailors of this strike group. They are the ones making this happen. I'm going to go see the Nimitz, the Princeton, and the Chafee. All three of these ships and their crews, the pilots, the ground crews for the aircraft, all working incredibly hard to make this happen. And one of the important things is that this is a drop-in fuel, that it could be any ships in the Navy, it could be any aircraft in the Navy. It just happens to be these three at the rim of the Pacific exercise. It's going to help the economy of the United States. It's going to help us develop a new energy economy to keep track with the rest of the world. Because what we don't want to do is trade one source of foreign energy for another source of foreign energy. It's helping our farmers. It's helping our entrepreneurs. It's helping our industrial base. It is helping in a whole lot of ways. But the main reason we're doing it is to make us better war fighters is to make us a better military force. Beside the fuel that we're using, we're gonna look at, one of the things I'm gonna to get to see today are the energy efficiencies that are being used on, right now in Chafee, but are beginning to move fleet wide. And these have the potential to save us literally a million barrels of fuel a year if, if it's done fleet wide. Just simple things like stern flaps, like voyage planning, like LED lights. These things all add up so that we can do the same job using less energy.